Where am I? Somewhere halfway between life and death. Child of Uchiha. Your eyes... It can't be. You're from the Uchiha clan too? <laughs> well, if you can feel pain, it means you are still alive. So you saved me? Thank you. You can thank me later. You see, I intend to make you pay me back in full. Okay, what do I need to do? I need to get back to the Hidden Leaf Village. We're in the middle of a war. And now that I've finally awakened my Sharingan, I'll be much better at protecting my allies. Protecting your allies? What? You will not be able to go on working as a ninja with that body. Wake up. Nothing in this world goes the way it should. Would you shut up already? I don't want to stay here forever. <laughs> Enough. Neither of us can get out of here. Not with these bodies. Just who are you? I am... the ghost of the Uchiha. Madara Uchiha. Uh, Madara? But Madara already died... ages ago. Then I suppose I am a relic from the past. It is true. If I was not receiving a steady supply of chakra from that statue back there, I would be dead in an instant. I am cheating death. Why would you capture a half-dead kid like me? We are going to break the cycle of cause and effect. Create a world with only victors. With only peace. With only love. A world that contains nothing but those things. Why should I care? Look, I just want to go back to my village, okay? If you want to die, that is your choice. But I shall take that eye of yours before you do. Why do you want my eye? Y you already have your own! And I am still missing a right eye. The Sharingan's true power is unleashed when the left and right come together, you see. So... That means if I stand shoulder to shoulder with Kakashi, I'll get even stronger. Then we'll really be able to keep Rin safe. Just another reason why I need to get out of here. Just wait, you two. I'm still alive. <laughs> I leave the rest to you. It's no use trying to act tough and hide your injuries. I've already seen them all. Rain. <laughs> he said her name again! <coughs> Ook, what the heck are you doing? I just saw that you had started mumbling about Rain again, so I got curious as to what kind of dream you were having. He... He always looks like such a loser when he's doing that. It's quite funny. He even drools sometimes. <laughs> hey, quit laughing, Guru Guru. Sorry. <sighs> it's been a while since I first got here. The first time I saw you, I was scared to death. Your puppets who were created from the statue, right? To us, you look like the real puppet. Yeah, you're human, yet half of your body is artificial just like ours. Worried about Madara? He went on and on about breaking the cycle of cause and effect or whatever, and then he goes to sleep forever. Oh, didn't you understand what Madara was talking about? Basically, his idea is to chuck out all the bad stuff in the world and run away to a dream world where everything's good. 
Since it's a dream world, you can do whatever you like. You can even bring dead people back to life. What? Now that just sounds ridiculous. <laughs> Maybe to you. Shut up! You're way stupider than me! Bingo! <laughs> Jeez, I don't know if you're making fun of me, or if you're the idiot. But I guess, I guess there's, there's no, no point, point in worrying about, about that, that now. now. I just I need to get, get used to this body, body as quickly as, as possible. possible. Come on, you guys. Time to get to work. Okay! More rehab, right? I take it you're ready? Of course! All right. Let's fight! I'm gonna go all out this time. Get ready! Bring it on! You could have a mercy, you know. I told you before we started, I'm going all out! Did you see them? Come on, I'll never forget. Come on, you two! You got me with a waste of What's your point? We don't know anything about you, Tosh. Huh? Uh -huh. Every time we fight, I realize just how well you've grasped the basics of fighting. Back to the hidden leaf, I'll be super strong. You won't believe her eyes. Win, win, win. That's all you ever talk about. I can see you. now than I ever was. I'd say so too. Half of your body is composed of special cells after all. Start calling us sensei if you want. Sorry, Minato's the only sensei I'll ever have. confidence in myself now. <sighs> it feels good. I've gotten more used to it than before. I really
really feel at home in my body now. No more awkwardness. Rin, Kakashi, we'll be together again soon. Oh no! Huh? I just went outside for a minute and saw that Rin person you keep talking about. She's in serious trouble! What happened? She and that Kakashi guy are surrounded by a bunch of hidden mist ninja! <laughs> You still can't break that rock yet. But I've got to go help Rin and Kakashi. Where my body then? But you work for Madara, right? Are you sure you're all right with this? You want to help your friends, don't you? Thanks, Gudaguru. Okay! You are leaving? I'm grateful to you for helping me. But yes, I'm leaving now. I have to! Okay, take me straight there! Okay, leave the navigation to me! My allies are standing guard all over the world. It'll be a cinch! How does it look? Uh, pretty bad. They keep talking about hidden mist experiments. I don't really get it. But there are a couple of dozen of them surrounding Rin and Kakashi. What is Minato Sensei doing? Who? I said, what do you think you're doing, Yellow Flash of the Leaf? I think he's wrapped up in another mission. He's nowhere nearby. Just when we need him most. Kakashi, you promised. Please. You've got to protect Reen. I'll be right beside you soon. Rain? No. That spray from the collision. Reen and Kakashi are in there. What's your plan? Isn't it obvious? I'm gonna charge straight in! <laughs> what the...? <laughs> Why am I seeing things? There's no way that actually happened! Kakashi and I were supposed to... Protect her! Wait... What's going on? What? <laughs> Back up! What an idiot! He's all alone! Take him out! <laughs>
mess with the Blood Mist Village. Since it's a dream world, you can do whatever you like. You can even bring dead people back to life. Rain, we'll be together again. I'll make a world where we can be together again. I'm going to break the cycle. That's why I decided to come back. Do you think that anyone saw you? I'm the only witness. Obito annihilated every last one of them. But it looks like he spared Kakashi. He was unconscious though, so he didn't see anything. Still attached to your old ally, are you? No. I just didn't care about him. It doesn't matter to me whether he lives or dies in this world. He'll join us in the new world we create. And so will Reen. Madara, show me how to create the dream world. You do not need to thank me anymore. This way, as of today, you are our savior. The dream world is extremely simple to create. All you need to do is take everyone into the Genjutsu world I have created. But you need to use the moon to magnify the scale of the Jutsu. Yes, let us see. First, I need to educate you about the Sage of the Six Paths and the Ten Tails. And then, about my project, Tsuki no Me. In a previous battle, I obtained some of Hashirama's DNA and transplanted it into my own body. And then, when I was on the brink of death, I awakened my Renegon. At the same time, I also broke a certain seal. I summoned the ghetto statue, the empty vessel of the Ten Tails from the moon. Then, I quickly used the statue as a medium to cultivate more of Hashirama's DNA. The result... was this. <laughs> I transferred my will into these beings. They are half me. Now, get to work, until I can be reborn, you are Madara Uchiha.
Do you remember what we talked about here when we were kids? Yes. Although at the time, I really thought you were joking. How cold. I'm not the kind of man who makes a joke about something like that. <laughs> you really were a strange one, though. What was it now? A school for the children? A safe village for your brothers? Hmm. I remember thinking that you had some pretty grand plans for a little kid. Oh? But they weren't bad dreams. They were the same as mine. Which is why I am here with you today. Yes. The Hidden Leaf Village. This village has become precious to me, and I must protect it. <laughs> so, have you thought about my Hokage idea some more? What? You were being serious about that. I thought you were just pulling my leg. What? No, I was being deadly serious. You would be perfect for the position. You'll be the leader of the village and guide everyone forward. And we'll carve a model of your face in the cliff here as an emblem of the village. Hey, I never agreed to that. It's not my style. It's not up to you. The more embarrassed you are, the better. You're just trying to torture me here, aren't you? <laughs> Very smart. It is a fine outfit. Well, it was supposed to be yours. I still think you'd make a better Hokage than I will. Well, it was a democratic decision. The villagers chose you. You are the Hokage. Madara. This stone. This stone has been passed down through generations of the Uchiha clan. It can be deciphered only by those with special eye abilities. This is as much as I can read so far. Seeking stability, there was a god who split into two halves, light and dark. Bringing the two halves together again grants the user the power of all creation. In other words, bringing two opposing forces together as one will lead to true happiness. But you can take it another way, too. <laughs> Never mind. There is no point in talking to you about it now. What do you mean? Hashirama, I am leaving the village. We are history. Huh? Wh why I do not have any allies here. No one looks up to me. But I can't do this without you. I need you as my right-hand man, as a brother. The people will soon come to see you for what you are. And when they do, you can be the second Hokage. I should think Tobirama will be your successor. If that happens, my clan will be doomed. I have tried to warn the other Uchiha of the danger and get them to leave the village. Save your breath. I am leaving. I have found another way. Wait! They're just misunderstanding you! Let us just say it comes down to how you perceive reality. Anyway, enough with the groveling. It is far healthier to see this world as a playground. Hey! Are you listening to me? You are the only one who can stand up to me. Mother! Until I reach the path to my true dream. Ugh! I shall enjoy fighting with you.
What is your true dream? Why wouldn't you explain it to me? Lord Hokage! What is it? It's... it's Madara Uchiha! He's coming! What? Really? He's come back? He's attacking the village! He wiped out the vanguard unit. We sent a second and third, but we've had reports of heavy casualties. We're working on evacuating the villagers. We just can't stop Madara's advance. What are we going to do? Hokage! What's the meaning of this? Why would... Madara, we built this place together, you and me. Why would you? It doesn't make sense. I can't understand you anymore. I can't... understand. Ambitions and machinations swirled in the dark night. Had the emotions of yesterday already run dry? Was despair the only thing that awaited? With unspeakable pain in his heart, Hashirama Senju challenged his friend. Believing that in this deep abyss, there was one last sliver of hope. Now that's a sight for sore eyes. I knew it was you, Sasuke! Cutting. I thought I sensed your chakra, so I busted out of jail to come and check. How dare you betray me like that! Why, Sasuke? Once he took you hostage, you became a burden. I'm never gonna forgive you for what you've done! Sorry. Uh, you... 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 You think sorry is gonna cut it? After everything you've put me through? I... 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 You good for nothing? I see you're as weak as always when it comes to Sasuke, Karin. Judging from the color of her hair, she must be from the Uzumaki clan. <laughs> sure brings back memories. My wife was from that same clan. Much as I enjoy hearing my brother reminiscing, save it for later. Hmm, yes, you're right. We must get to the battlefield as soon as possible. No, there's something we need to do first. Hmm? We can head to the battlefield. However, I'm doubtful as to whether we should be taking this lot along with us. What do you mean by that? I mean, if you're going to get under our feet, you should just stay away. That's how you see us, is it? Not you, Orochimaru. You're fine. But the others... Then why don't you put them to the test? I intend to. Hmm. Very well. I'm in too. It will do me good to move my limbs a bit before the battle. Sarutobi, join us. Let's all fight together. It's been too long. <sighs> Understood. Then it's decided. Sasuke, Jugo, and Suigetsu. Show them what you can do. What? Why me? Karin's a healer. You men are the combat specialists, aren't you? And where is this test to take place? Surely not here. Don't be ridiculous. 
We'll go to the place Hashirama and I used to use for training. Ah, yes. We shouldn't be disturbed here. Good. So, the three of us have decided to test your strength as fighters. If you fail to impress us... Save the explanations. Let's just do this. Hey, hey, stop, stop taunting them! <laughs> Suits me. We don't have much time. Oh, impressive. He's covering himself perfectly. This should be fun. fight in the war too, right? So if we go easy on them and... Now then, let's see what you've got. This seems kind of scary. Atmosphere's my wooden dragon! Let me fight. That's my chance. Now is the time. Play control. Push them right to the brink before we see their truth. What are you playing around for? Water style! Water shockwave! Sigets! I knew it'd be me! I won't be able to hold on forever! Come on! Got it! Not bad. Wood style, wood expo. 
Battle Shinjutsu. <laughs> now, what will it be? Yes, that will do. So, how do we do? I imagine Madara will be surprised to see such powerful ninja arrive. In other words? I suppose this means you passed. Yes. I admit that you're stronger than I imagined. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> now then, the other group is waiting. Back to the village! Aha! Sasuke! Sorry to keep you waiting. How did they do? Oh yes, excellent. We'll all be heading straight to the battlefield. Hokage! It's time at last. As we stand atop the mountainside images that have long watched over the hidden leaf, let the sight of the village be imprinted in our minds as we charge into battle to defend it. I'll be able to see my son at last, Naruto. I haven't been able to be much of a father to you, so I'm going to try to make it up to you now. I'm bringing a big present with me. I haven't fought a war in a long time. I'd better keep my wits about me. Madara, I'm going to defeat you once and for all. I know it's inappropriate, but I can't deny that I'm excited about seeing my old friend again. There's always fighting in this world. But this is going to be the last war. To battle! Do you want? I'm going to extract the Nine Tails from you and cross the leaf. Now, come on out, Nine Tails. Notice me?
I am your opponent. And you're done for. He got away so fast. My old sensei is still powerful. But I'm faster now. You shall not escape. Who are you? Why are you attacking the leaf? What good would it do if I told you? You'll all be finished in no time anyway. There's no hope for you. Is that all you've got? Is the village distracting you or the children? Either way, since you can't seem to concentrate on the battle, you're going to die. I won! Flying Raichi, level two! I expected no less of you, Forth. You actually managed to damage me. But in the end, everything will bend to my will. I shall rule this world. There are plenty of ways to go about it. The Nine Tails came out completely uncontrolled. Is that a problem? The Hidden Leaf has been completely devastated. For a while, they'll be too busy fixing up the village to do anything else. I see. And while they're distracted, we move. We have a lot to prepare for Project Tsukinomi. We could do with the great nations looking the other way for the time being. Let's go. This world is pitch black. Minato Sensei. I'm sick of this. I don't care.
about this world anymore.